Hey everyone, uh, this is my first jet vlog. Um, it is 2.52 in the morning central time. I am at work, obviously. I got my sweet uniform on, with my badge, whatever, my patch. Anyways, it's an easy job. Obviously I'm sitting here doing nothing. So, um, I'll try to keep this halfway short because it's my first one. Um, my name is Cassidy. I got shortlisted in the JET program. I went through the Chicago consulate. Uh, applied back in November. Had a great interview. Really felt good coming out of that. And um, I may or may not talk more about that at a later date. Um, we'll see. So, but anyways, had a good interview. Um, first off, I want to give thanks to Jason. Uh, I believe his YouTube account is my Ergonauts. Um, if you are viewing this and looking into the Jet program, I would highly recommend going over to his his uh, YouTube channel. Uh, he has over a hundred videos on the Jet program, and it's just super helpful. He was pretty much my main source as I filled out my application and prepared for the interview. Um, so thank you, Jason. Alright, I had to take a break there because I'm at work and I had to stop and attend to somebody. Anyways, so um, head on over to Jason's channel if you're looking into the JET program. He's got everything you could want, so thank you, Jason. Uh, arigatou gozaimasu. Um, my Japanese still sucks, I'll be honest with you. I know a couple phrases and I know the Japanese word for poop. I don't know why, but I do. Anyways, I need to stop going off topic here. Um, what I wanted to cover with this uh, first vlog is my three things I've learned this far and I'm also going to name them the three stays because I realized all three of them started with the word stay so first one stay off the message boards um, I mean let's be honest here people are freaking out on the message boards and it is ridiculous um, and so you go on the forums and the message boards and I mean it has very good information, very useful information but I found my str myself to come, to come away from those more stressed than when I came into the forums uh, just people speculating and jumping to conclusions and well I heard this and I heard this and what if it's like this and let's it's just ugh it's like a soap opera so um, Limit your time on them, I guess I would say. Uh, I spent a little bit of time on the forums just to get some general questions answered. Um, but didn't really spend much time on them, and that's maybe because I prefer to stay away from drama as much as possible. Um, I guess that's up to you, but I stayed off of them. So. Uh, second one, stay busy. Okay, It's a long application process. Oh dear lord, is it a long application process. Uh, I think I turned my application in early, it was right around the 1st of, Dece first of November, I think. Uh, didn't get notified of an interview until late January, interview was in February. Had to wait another month to find out that I had been shortlisted, which means that I am pretty much guaranteed a job. Um, and now it's another month until I find out where I'm actually going to be living and teaching. So, it's a waiting game. Uh, so just stay busy during that time. There's people that are just always like on the edge of their seats and can't think about anything else. And luckily, I had school. Um, I had four jobs. I, I mean, I had a girlfriend. Um, I stayed busy, and it kept my mind off of things. It helped time move a little faster. And, I mean, of course, so, you know, a week up until the interview and a week up until the results and all that you know of course I was checking my email multiple times a day but um, staying busy really helps with that with that sort of stuff so try to stay busy um, it'll help the time move faster and you don't want to be sitting around fretting about something you can't control anyway it's out of your control just live life it'll happen when it's supposed to happen so my last stay is stay intelligent oh dear lord you might not understand this until you get closer to the interview stage actually it happened in the application stage um, 
what should we put for this line? What should we put for this line? Do we put this line? Do we staple it? Okay. There's some question marks, okay? But we're all adults, okay? We're all potentially moving to a foreign country to live on our own. Use your brain, okay? Um, perfect example. A short listed people had to fill out a whole bunch of paperwork. There was an IRS form that you had to pay $85 in order to get another IRS form. So, um, with that, they gave us step-by-step -step directions. Literally, line three, write this. Line four, write this. Okay, they were step-by-step -step directions. And it never fails, the message boards fill up with, what do we put in line three? Use your brain. So, anyways, enough of me being a little drama queen and I just said I don't like drama, and then here I go spot in my mouth. So, um, it's a it's a great process. You learn a lot about yourself. Um, I had a great time, even though I'm still stressing a little bit. And I'm sure I will be still, but um, I would really encourage you to to give it a shot and go for it. You know, it's it's one of the most uh, highly respected programs in Japan. Um, it's worth it. So, uh, that's about all I got. I'm running up on seven minutes. Oh, probably six minutes by the time I get done editing this. But, um, so, my next one, I have no idea. It might not be until I get uh, notified of my placement. But, uh, hope you enjoyed this one. I hope that it helps somebody in some way. Uh, once again, thank you, Jason. I really appreciate it. Uh, Jason's great. Even I even messaged him a couple times and he responded within the next day or so. So, um, I mean, he's a busy man. Don't overload him with random pointless questions. But if you have a legitimate question, um, you know, you can shoot it my way or shoot it his way. Or there's a ton of other people um, that put jet vlogs out there uh, for people to watch and people to learn from. So use their wisdom, use their experience. Um, don't go off of people on message boards who are going through it for the first time too or uh, the people that say I didn't make it last time but I seem to know everything about the process so um, anyways so uh, we will talk to you later and have a good one